I'm Candy Caldwell with Wedding Makeup by Candy Caldwell. I specialize in bridal makeup and special event makeup with 19 years experience. I have worked on print, I have worked on videos and post-production in um, the video world. Today we're going to be featuring a model, Sabrina. She's getting married 2013 and I'm going to be showing you what I can do for the day of your wedding. We want to emphasize on eyes. I think we're going to do something with a smoky eye and um, I'm going to give you a few tips on how to make your wedding day makeup run smoothly for that day. Sabrina, how are you? Good, Candy. How are you? Congratulations on your upcoming wedding. Thank you. I am so excited to be able to work with you and come up with some ideas. What we're going to do today is we're going to do a real soft, natural look, but um, smoky eye. Okay, perfect. Um, so what I'm going to do is um, I'm putting on a little bit of primer because okay. I want to prime your face. And that helps your um, foundation stay on a little bit longer. And then I'm okay. um, putting on a little primer onto the top of your eyes. Then what I'm going to do is we're going to conceal. And what we're going to do is we just want to go in and do a little concealer. Okay. And what I've done is we're going to use a liquid foundation and then we're going to top it off with a powder. A setting powder is going to help your makeup last a little bit longer okay. for that day. Candy, can I ask you a question? Mm -hmm. How do you pick the true foundation for yourself if I were to be doing this on my own, the well, true color? Well, what you want to do, what I have found, is the best time to pick your foundation is daylight. Okay. Um, and what you want to do is you want to do a strip test. Mm -hmm. And what you do is you're going to take three colors that you think are in your shade tone. Well, what I'm doing now, this is called our base, mm -hmm. and it has a bit of a shimmer in, in it because I find uh, for weddings, um, people tend to like that little bit of shimmer. and Princess-like. Yeah. And one thing that um, I, I'm glad that you did is um, took a look at some of the makeup that we had in this book. This is one of the classes that I've taken. Oh yes, I loved it. And um, so I always like you to be able to pick out and see something that maybe will work for your eye shape or that. So right. we have picked um, something that's going to be real Beautiful. smoky. Yes. Okay. And then what I'm going to do later is I'm going to actually take a photograph of you okay. and in my wedding file, then I will put your picture um, along with all of my notes are going to go right in this folder. So you can Perfect. see um, this is a hairstyle yes. and makeup that um, one of my brides brought to me. And so then what I've done is I've taken her picture and I have all of her information. Your information will go into this folder. Okay. And so that just helps me be prepared when I go Perfect. and then I make all my notes. So that's how I can remember what we're doing. What you're doing. Perfect. When you're working with the tan, Meaning, um, if we do the makeup, let's say today, and I'm not that tan, it'll be, we're getting married in September, so I'll be a bit more tan. Should I just go and bring perhaps two foundations, one a little bit darker? Because I tend to get a lot darker when I go to Italy. And I always, personally, mm -hmm. I have two or three foundations, and what I do is I actually mix and match is what I personally oh, okay. do Perfect. is I mix and match. So what I'm doing is I'm putting a little color into your contour. And again, we're going to not go too dramatic, but we're going to have nice pop on your eyes. Now is your dress going to be sleeveless? Yes, but it'll have, um, I have a little jacket to cover up just for the for the church part of it uh -huh. and then it's coming off. Is he Italian too? No, he's French Canadian, complete opposite. And I'm using a liner. Okay. 
and it's into black. it's black right into okay. your um, and I'm gonna blend that right in but I'm, I'm doing it with short little strokes right so we can get it. right into I want to get into your hairline okay and one thing that we always want to do is we want to always curl your lashes too so one of my favorite tools is a slanted brush. And so what we're going to do is we're just going to go right back in and blend this out. And I'm going to use a little bit of eyeshadow, which is called um, black eyeshadow. And you can do so much with it. You can use it as an eyeshadow or you can use it. Um, I line, line a lot with it. And what I like about your makeup is your makeup is very um, Audrey Hepburn. Ah, I get that sometimes. With your hair up and everything, mm -hmm. it looks really pretty. Um, so what I'm doing is I picked a little bit of a peach color, which is going to keep you still looking fresh and uh, young. And, and then what we're going to do is we're going to top it off. with a, a browner lip gloss. And I like using the lip gloss. I like that wet look. Mm -hmm. it smells good. And especially when you're young and beautiful as you are. Thank you. Okay. Now, what happens is when you put on white, your makeup's going to change. Now we have black on. Right. And so what I'd like to do is I'd like to just, and then this way too, is I can always see what I need to adjust and what not. Oh, I want to drape you with white because I want you to get a sense of, you're going to have a lot of skin showing that day. So what I like to do is I like to show um, you. Okay. And try to cover up all of this so you get a sense. Oh. And, um, yep. I, uh, that's what they always say, but I, I always like to pull down the hair and double bun. You did, didn't you? Mm. And just give you some idea. Because what's going to happen is if you're going to wear a veil. Mm -hmm. I will. Okay. okay, what they're going to do is they've got to have a bump up here. Oh, okay. Or somewhere <laughs> they've got to have something that's going to hook your veil into. So if you're thinking of something half up, half down, all the way up, I wouldn't go too tight to the head. Um, but this is a little bit of how you're going to look that day of your wedding. Okay, don't cry, right? Push the... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, it's beautiful. I like that a lot. <laughs> One of my greatest accomplishments is I've learned how to bring out the natural beauty of a bride on her special day. So think Candy Caldwell and say yes to wedding makeup by Candy Caldwell.